Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video on the channel. And today, guys, we're going to be checking out Steven Bergwijn's uh, Future Stars card, guys. So I'm excited for this one today. <clears throat> I think he's going to be uh, a very, very interesting card because he, he does remind me of Lautaro Martinez in a way where he has incredible stats, but it's like, how good is he in game? Does he really play uh, to what the stats say? So he's a lot of coins. He's one 0.07 mil, um, which is a lot. And so for a million coins, we're going to have to evaluate how good is this guy. Now, to you guys who have been watching all the reviews of the channel, thank you guys so much uh, for just the insane support. The support on the channel has been insane. I'm glad you guys are enjoying the videos. We have a Future Stars playlist if you guys are curious with a lot of these cards, uh, if you want to check them out. And if you guys want me to review any others that we haven't reviewed so far, just let me know. Let me know in the comments down below. And, uh, other than that, the reviews will keep coming for you guys. So anyways, this guy today, 4-star, four 4-star, four uh, 94 pace, 92 dribbling, 89 shooting, 85 passing, and 83 physical. Uh, he's five foot ten, And when we take a look at the traits, he does have some really nice traits. Outside foot shot trait is really nice. Long shot taker is really nice. And flare trait is nice. So he's going to be able to shoot the ball from long distance. And he's also got a lot of dribbler traits, which are very nice to have as well. Uh, 95 acceleration, 94 sprint speed, 89 attack positioning, 88 finishing, 93 shot power, 91 long shots. Just incredible, incredible stats there um, with some of those stats. So he's got some really nice stats there. Um, 90 short passing, 84 curve, 97 balance guys, 89 agility, which makes him very responsive, uh, 88 reactions. So there's a lot to like about this card. I mean, there really is. His passing at 90 is really good. Um, 88 reactions is also really good. Ball control is really good. And I think the thing that's the most unique about Steven Bergwijn's card is that he's got 94 strength. I mean, how does that work out in game? We'll have to see. That 94 strength, though, is very, very appealing to me. And I think that could make for a card that is potentially really good in game. So we'll see how that plays, guys. Um, and uh, today, guys, I think for me, the chemistry style that I really want to try out on Steven Bergwijn is probably a dead eye or a finisher. I think I'm going to go with a dead eye because I think we can get away. I think we can get away, guys, in game um with the ni the 90 the 74 short passing so i think a dead eye for me is probably going to be the best option sorry a finisher is going to be the best option because with a finisher chemistry style we're going to get the boost um on the shooting and then the dribbling right and i think that's really what we want to do i'm really already happy with the pace his pace is already very high and so i think for us guys today the best chemistry style for this card is probably going to be a finisher now we're going to have to also make sure that we get a proper manager in. We need to make sure that our manager uh, is a Premier League manager. So we're going to go ahead and change the league just because for the review today, we're going to be testing out him uh, specifically in this league. So also, we need to make sure that we get a striker in here uh, that can link with him. And for just for banter, we'll put Ian Rush. So guys, we're going to check him out today. And again, let's get into the video now. Put the coach's plans into action. Let's wow, that strength he just had. That strength was incredible there, though. He just knocked over Joe Gomez. Time and time again, and he's now just gone and fluffed his Great run. Ooh, the power on that shot was insane. Oh, my gosh. That power was just crazy on the finesse shot. I'm very impressed with that. It's a lovely through ball to set up the chance. I love his runs, man. His runs are so good. Oh, the speed boost there. We did not get to finish. I didn't take the best angle, but man, is this guy feeling good so far. Oh, I love that acceleration there. We got an Avery now on the breakaway. Oh, the nutmeg. Dude. Wow. Stevie B, who would have thought, guys? Stevie B is this solid, man. He's feeling nice in game. Nice ball. To the advanced position. In position. Nah, this card is cracked. There was an AI block, but man, he dribbled three players. The left stick is already crazy on this card. 
Look at the pace on this card, man. And they need to get tighter here. Joe Gomez catches up, but the pace is crazy on this card. Going short. Teammate available. Gnabry. It's with Bergwijn. On the weak foot. Oh my gosh, he balls broke the net. Oh my gosh, dude. He almost broke the net on his weak foot. I was testing that weak foot cross net angle, and man, he smashed it. And now the second half is underway. Strength there, man. Wow. And he takes on the shot. Not a bad shot there. Keeper had it red. Looks promising this. Is this the moment? Oh, that block was insane. And return to Gnabry. Ooh, what a ball! What a pass! Oh, it's just offside. What a play. I mean, his ability on the ball is absolutely Nice turn. He doesn't his strength on Walker there. The finesse shot! Oh my gosh, I thought that was dipping in. No finesse shot trade, but almost gets that one to go. He made it look simple, really. Come on, Stevie. Bro, this guy's outrunning Kyle Walker right now, man. This guy is outrunning Kyle Walker, and the pass was so bad. I did a through ball. Why didn't it work? Did I need to do a cross there? Oh, that pass was so bad. No, he did everything there, man. Was that the long passing at 74? I don't know. Grealish. High quality defending. Nice dribbling there. His strength is really noticeable when he comes in and receives the ball. It's really hard for anybody to take him off the ball. Ooh, the power shot after the directional nutmeg. Jeez, bro, the power on this guy's shot is absurd. Great pass. Plenty of room in the wide area. Has eyes for goal. Oh, he's really up on the map here. Ooh, good strength. Turns Kyle Walker, and the Kyle Walker gets the block. But man, the pace off that pass, the strength there was pretty, pretty incredible. Getting anxious when they have the ball. Great run inside. Can he get the shot off? Another auto block, man. Another auto block. Got a little bit closer that time. Good run inside. Let's see what we can do here, man. The strength against Kyle Walker. Ah, oh, I just took a big touch. Man, his power, pace, and his strength is so impressive. Oh, no, the pulls. The post, man. On the weak foot. Oh, Virgil blocks it again. Against Kyle Walker, and he gets it to go, man. Stevie B, man, has given us some incredible finishing, man. Man. Oh my gosh, that strength is insane. Look at this guy against all these players, man. Oh, good defending to stop a decent. Can I Oh, a lovely ball. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. The high press was on. Oh, the strength. So lucky, but the strength is the reason that Bergwijn was able to win that ball off Van Dyke because he is so hard to take off the ball that even when you take him off the ball, he has the strength to like keep pushing through, man. It's crazy to see that strength. It's the oh, this card is so crazy. Like, the dribbling is so insane on this guy, man. All that work in the week, all that chat in the dressing room, all that stops now. It's put your game face on. Get down to it. I'm really looking forward to this one. You'll have a go here. Ooh, almost from the finesse angle. He's failed to hold it, Neymar. Oh, what a save from Pope, man. Long way out there. Ooh, almost. Really good high press. Ooh, got him. The post. How? How do we just hit the post? I think I read timed it. That's why. Oh, my God. He's missed that. I don't know why he did that weird animation. Great strength. Stay with it. Stay with it. Great strength. Oh. Nice. Nice, Stevie. Well, still searching nice. But we finished that. Oh, my. 
Oh, FIFA, man. Okay, guys. So, overall, uh, Stevie Bergwijn was really, really good. Uh, really good. I was really impressed with this card. I mean, I thought there was so much to this card that I didn't actually expect. And I guess the main thing is that his power shots, his shooting in the box is unreal. But really, his quick agility combined with strength makes this card literally broken. I mean, this card was really good in-game. Um, very impressed with this guy. The only downsides you have to consider is the, the passing from the longer distances was noticeable. So that's always going to be a challenge because you do want to boost the finishing. And I think that's why, because of the finisher camp style, this guy was so good. Um, he feels like a more agile version of Sun, if I'm going to compare it to somebody. Feels like a more agile version of Sun. Felt really good on the ball. The stock was noticeable. Um, the long shots weren't anything crazy. But I thought overall, this guy was really solid. So for the price, I mean, 1 million coins, I'm going to give this guy an 8586. I thought he was really, really good in game. Um, and I thought his shooting and it combined with his strength was pretty freaking broken. So that's my verdict on Bergwijn. If you enjoyed it today, guys, drop a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in review soon. Peace.